<laughs> yeah, absolutely. And look, there's, there's so much to admire, Liam, with Real. But just to maybe dwell on the Atletico point for a, a, a bit, you know, you've, I suppose, the two clubs in the city, one going in opposite directions, one moving out of the city, going to a new stadium. And we've seen, you know, the likes of West Ham and even Arsenal know about it. When you go to a new ground, it takes a while to settle in. It, may, it takes a while for it to feel like home. Griezmann may leave, Simeone. I don't know, will they be able to tempt him to stay? He seemed, as Eamon said, very adamant last season at the end of the Champions League. I'm done. Well, I think he's done an absolute marvellous job at Atletico. Incredible to bring them from where they were when he took over to the heights that they've reached. Uh, two Champions League finals. Uh, another, again, another semi-final. Very unlucky not to win at least one Champions yeah. League. Last minute goal, Ramos scored, denies them. He has to go into extra time. Uh, but like Eamon, I agree that this cycle is probably coming to the end. And they are a selling club. Uh, and they won't be only it won't be only Griezmann that other clubs are interested in. Carrasco is a fine player. Uh, Sal Niguez is a fine player. I think you find that they'll be on anyone's shopping list. Um, they played so well tonight to begin with for the first 20-25 minutes, and a moment of magic from Benzema, or a moment of madness from three experienced yeah. defenders, cost them. If they had gone in at half-time with that coach, winning 2-0, you just don't know what would have happened. You know, Real would have had to dwell on the fact that they were 2-0 down. So they really, really will be kicking themselves. Three experienced defenders to be done by one player. Uh, you know, it's... But they have a bit of class. I thought Modric kind of got his team back in it by just settling everybody down. He wasn't nervous. Varane, as Eamon mentioned, was nervous. Uh, Danilo looked a weakness in the Real Madrid team. But when Modric got the ball, he just calmed everything down, picked the right pass most of the time. And they were coming at him to get him, but he just sidestepped them beautifully and kept the ball. It was a real masterclass from a really great midfield player. Yeah, we're going to look at him in, in due course in real detail because...